Hey, Clint Butler here. We're, uh, I wanted to do a video on how to find your YouTube feed. Now, the reason this came up is I do a lot of SEO stuff, and I want to make sure you know, if I'm creating a backlink somewhere, whether it be YouTube or anywhere else, that that backlink is indexed. Now, as you know, uh, you can put your URL inside of the description box for your videos, and plus, if you're making a, a, a video that sort of matches the same topic, as your post it makes sense to you know put that link to your original post that you did on top of the video as well uh, just like I did with this one um, so what we're gonna do is go over uh, how to accomplish this first let me show you that if you look in the new browsers now what you're looking here is a uh, is Firefox I have Safari Opera uh, Google Chrome uh, on here as well but um, all of them kinda eliminated that RSS feed button. It, I'm sure it's still here. It's somewhere, but it's kind of a, a pain in the butt to find. Um, so the RSS feed button doesn't work. And then let's go to YouTube. Now I'm on my YouTube account, and then you see there's no listing in here. They don't say, "Hey, here's your RSS feed." So you know, you check your channel, and in the, your channel you have this little box that says feed. Now, if you look at the URL, and I highlight that so it kind of sticks out a little bit more, um, it, it says this is your feed. When you try to plug that into, uh, you know, um, Ping or Pixel, Pixel, um, any of the other RSS feed submitters, that doesn't actually it doesn't work um, because it's not showing correctly. So, but there is a little trick you can do, and I got this little string of code um, from another site. And all you do is replace this little section right here with your username. So, username.com, enter, ta da, there's your RSS feed. Now you can use this and submit this to the aggregators to make sure that your videos are indexed. Now, with your videos being indexed, it'll also find your backlink to your website as well. Uh, so you get a two for your video. Hopefully, it will rank as long as you're, you know, your keyword optimizing your title and your descriptions, and your uh, your original post or on your site will actually get ranked as well. That that page that you're ranking within the uh, within the YouTube description will get one more backlink to it. Uh, there are some whether you know it is a a no follow link, and they say it doesn't matter. Is it any good? Well, you know, all the links that I ever put on YouTube. Um, be no follow or not, they still show up in my webmaster tools and there's still a credit um, by Google as a backlink to my website. So um, don't pay attention too much to, to the no follow relationship that you get out of YouTube. The link still matters, it's still, uh, it's still important. You get so what you're ca uh, capturing here is views to your video, uh, visitors to your website, backlinks to your website, no PR is transferred, who cares, it's still another backlink to your website. Uh, and then, uh, you know, hopefully, in turn, more targeted visitors, more sales, leads, signups, whatever it is you're looking for. So I hope this helps. If you need the uh, string of code, I know you can't, you know, you can't really see it too well up here. Um, just go into the description box of this video. It'll take you to the post, and you'll see this video on the the original blog post that I did, and a little bit more things that you can do with an RSS feed for your YouTube. Um, is there as well and that string that you can just copy that right off the site plug it in and uh, SEO away good luck and let's talk to you later